Hey folks, it's me, M64 Bros. And one year ago, an awesome YouTuber named Chris Baker made a video called Neversoft Spider-Man 2000. Neversoft Spider-Man game got an official movie mod. So basically, way back then, I've already seen his complete video, so while Spider-Man 2 was very popular during that time, Activision decided to go to Neversoft and decided to, like, make a new port of the game, but this time, make the entire skin Spider-Man based on his 2002 suit. And let me tell you, I'm assuming during that time, Spider-Man 2, 2002 was very, very popular. While a lot of people are talking about just the regular Sam Raimi suit, but why isn't no one talking about, like, the 2002 Sam Raimi suit? Like, the differences between the, f the one we all know and love and this one is... The logo is completely different, and the spider logo on the back of Spider-Man is completely expanded, like, sticking very slow, very, very close to comic book accurate. And yeah, there are some people out there who actually love the 2002 Spider-Man suit more than the regular one. So yeah, to be honest, I love them both. So once I watched this video, and as ready as I was to get my hands on the game, well mainly because it's not really that expensive on eBay, I actually reached out to Chris Baker and I told him this question as I was getting ready to buy the game on eBay. Oh, and I gotta find him. Alright, there we go. I actually reached out to Chris Baker and I told him before I get my hands on the Windows 10 version, he told me I just recorded it all on the Windows 10 machine I purchased back in 2015. So we're going to test out the Spider-Man 2000 on my Windows computer. But of course, we're going to unbox it first, so give me a sec. There we go. Alright, let's see what it looks like. And... Wow. Just wow. So this is what the disc looks like, and yeah, I knew it was from Activision. And yeah, it's what's already used, and yeah, by the looks of it, it looks very, very good. So give me a second. So thankfully, my computer right here has a little bit of a DVD drive. <laughs> so yeah, pretty cool. Oh man, even the disc version looks very, very cool. So yeah, here we go. Stick it in there. Pushing in gently. There we go. I'm gonna hop on the computer and see if it works. Here we go. And my jacket as always. So it turns out the software actually works as well now. So we're gonna see, go to demo and I'm gonna be a little bit careful with this right now so I won't like screw it up from the get go. The launcher, maybe this is it. Let's find out. Being a little bit careful, hopefully I don't like screw up my PC from the get go. Why is my mouse? Oh, it's working. Got milk. I always drink chocolate milk during that time. Bought you by Got Milk. Okay, I've never seen any. I've only seen Spider-Man 2's gameplay, but I've never seen anything like this. That is a big, big spider than expected. Hey, it's J. Jonah Jameson. Shocker. Vulture. Of course, the big green himself. Green Goblin. Wow. That intro was pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. So, uh, all right, sweet. Yeah, I've seen the video and... What? 
This has gone even 10 times cooler. So yeah, we are looking at the game art of this game, and by the looks of it, I've never seen anything like this. Very, very impressive. God, Milk, official movie site. I wonder if you can actually still go to the movie. I'm actually curious now, Red. Alright, I'm right with the main Spider-Man 2, so yeah. Alright, but of course, we're here for this. Install. I will admit, I do love the presentation of this, so... Yes. So, I'm... Um... Oh, now we're talking. Blah, 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 sell my soul to this, and yeah. Oh, sweet. I'm very excited for this. So yeah, I've never seen anything like this. This is my first time doing a PC old school game review of this. I'm just happy it still works. So yeah. Like, oh my god, my goodness no. Like, for a movie that hasn't, like, I've never seen anything like this. Like, just a reminder, I was born in 2000, but I have never seen any movie posters like this before. Like, <clears throat> you can really tell, like, Sony wanted to make a Spider-Man movie, like, 2001, Sony Pictures, and yeah. I mean, I've never seen anything like this. Like, they told the actors of who they are. Kristen Dusk is Mary Jane Wat Watson, and yeah. Oscorp Technologies. So that's what the original Oscorp looks like. Very impressive. Very cool. <clears throat> oh yeah, for entertainment, I... For this review, of course, I do have some box for J.K. Simpsons is J. Jonah Jameson. <laughs> Man, looking at J. Jonah Jameson now and from the past is very, very cool. Harry Osborne. Mm. Alright, here we go. Mm. Alright, fine. So, I'm assuming we played the demo now. I'm excited to play this. Now, this is my first time playing a Neversoft Spider-Man game on my PC. I won't play through all of it, but I am going to be testing this out and probably do a live stream of it. So, yeah. So, here goes nothing. Mm -hmm. God milk. I'm aware. And then other stuff. So, uh... Can you skip the cutscene? Oh, you can. <gasps> All right. Here we go. You boys ready? Because I've been looking forward to this ever since, so... Does it show my face cap? Eh, I guess not. Oh, crap. Um, well... <laughs> looks like I'm doing this faceless now. Oh, my God. It's the Unisoft logo. Never soft, I mean, sorry. Bam. Neversoft.com. We will miss you. Treyarch. Very cool. Gray Master Matter. I'm assuming that's the software they ported the game, so yeah. Press enter. Whoa. Okay. I've never played a Spider-Man Neversoft game, but by the looks of it, it looks pretty cool. Hold on, I want to see if the recorder's still going well. All right, here we go. Kid mode. I'll do easy. 
Oh man. Okay, for a PC game, I have never, ever, ever in my life, like, I've always wanted to try Unisoft Spider-Man game on PC, like, true, I have tried an emulator of it on the N64, but I've never seen anything like this before, so yeah. I can't skip. Alright. Also, worst of all, I can't hear any sound. But that's okay. Yo, that is a shiny, shiny, beautiful outfit. All right, we'll practice controls right now. All right, so, oh yeah, back in the day. So, uh, how does the controls work? I want to find. Oh yeah, so it's the old. So yeah, like back in the day, you gotta like. So which key am I supposed to press on? Uh. Love that textures. Oh, we even have the movie. Oh, plus pad nine to swing. Um, an air jump. So how do I jump? Uh, do I just press one of the enter button or shift or something else or what do I press? Eh. Do I just press how it? Do I need to set up a controller or something or? So yeah. Um, I got the pads ready. So. Oh, I got seven. All right, eight's jump. Oh, number two is so number two is. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, I think I know where this is going. Huh. All right, I know how this is working. So yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to go play a little bit of Fortune. Yeah. All right, here we go. Hmm. Hmm. So number nine. All right. So two is jump. Four is to punch, of course. Five, six is to do the. Six is to kick. Eight is to web zip stuff, and nine is to. Okay then. Well, hope you guys love this. Well, all right. Let's pause right here. First, I need to commit suicide. I can't pause. Be Quit. So after setting up completely and seeing all that presentation, I can safely give this game a 5 out of 5. Also, huge props and message to Chris Baker, and I'm just letting you know, if you're watching this video, I just want to let you know that the game works well on my PC, and it works smoothly. Also, huge thanks to Chris Baker for all the other stuff, and yeah. I just want to say to Chris Baker, it works. Other than that, hope you guys liked this video. Subscribe for more, and I'll see you guys in the next video.